name is Ellen. This week I am reviewing this 11 Clean Boost pedal. For those of you who aren't pedal nerds like me, a Clean Boost pedal increases the output volume of your signal. But Ellen, you might be saying, don't amps and guitars come with volume knobs already? To which I say in response, calm down. I will have as many volume knobs as I can well please. So you operate this pedal by putting plugs into it. It's the same way that you operate a spewing fire hydrant. Is the spewing fire hydrant good or should I? I love I? it. I mean, it doesn't make, it Does it makes make like sense? 50% sense, but I like it. It makes just enough. Alright, that's fair enough. 50%? 50% is like all-star batting average. I've got the knob all the way down right now. No appreciable change in volume. It does kind of impart a color. It's a little... It darkens the sound a little bit. But not in a way that's unpleasant and it actually kind of rolls off some of the harshness. harshness. Now, with the knob around 9 o'clock, to me, that just sounds like we've just cranked the amp up a notch. If you want a really transparent clean pedal, this might not be the option. But if you want a pedal that adds a nice color, you know, I love colors. Blue, green. As you can see, when I turn the knob up, it's louder. This should not come as a surprise. If this comes as a surprise to you, please start the video over and pay better attention. I've got the thing at, at straight up and down. This is a pretty substantial clean boost. This would be a good like solo boost. To not add any distortion to your sound, just enough volume to kick it up to the next level. I like the way that it kind of thickens up the mids a little and rolls off some of that high end. We're going to use this with the uh, knob over here at... Um, Whatever time it is when the little hand is pointing this way. Three o'clock. Now you can see we're starting to add some grit into the tone a little bit. It's not quite as clean. Just a little bit of higher, a little bit of growly noises. Now I have the pedal maxed out. It's causing the amp to make this noise. Ah! Whoa. Whoa. We're not going to do that again. If there was customers in the store, they're dead. We've killed them. <laughs> Oh, that one has emerged. Thank goodness. We well, use in the restroom. He's protected. Oh, good. Yeah, that's. They tell you to do that when, when in a in a in a clean boost pedal warning. Right. Seek <laughs> shelter in a room with no windows. <laughs> you guys, Johnny Stanton is here. He plays bass and he's great. Hey, everybody. Johnny, do you have anything you'd like to say about clean boost pedals? Uh, uh nope. I'm gonna deduct an Ellen for not having an external power option. I'm also gonna deduct an Ellen for being ugly. So, turns out, gets a total of three out of five Ellens. Ellen! 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 Today, for the vintage clothing portion of our show, I have picked out this Heilman's work shirt because nostalgia is happening everywhere. Okay. You should do this before the door's open. It's gigantic, like most things I try on on this show. Do you guys know about old style? It's beer, and it's not good beer. But it's from Chicago, but not really, it's kind of from Wisconsin. But they just have a lot of it in Chicago, and they have it on the commercials during the Cubs games. G. Highland Brewer coming Milwaukee, Wisconsin, that's what they say. Would make a good paint smock. It would be better if I tucked it in. You look like an employee, certainly. Yes, I oh. feel like an employee. I would be careful how much... Whoa. I have a big splash zone. I want to bring back the time in the show where Ellen asks you, the audience, a thing. As always, folks, you are invited to leave your thoughts, suggestions, complaints in the comments below. Please feel free to send anything through the post. The address is 1101 Holly Street, Nashville, Tennessee, 37206. It's always so much fun to get mail. It, it, I love it. I don't know why I love it so much. Or write to your grandma. Is it her birthday? It's my granddad's birthday today. I'm going to uh, call him later. That's good. He's 88. That's great. Mm -hmm. Happy birthday, granddad. Yeah. Um, Do we have a picture of him, maybe? Sure. Edited a picture of my granddad. That's what it is. <laughs> Thank you for watching Ellen's favorite thing at Fannies of the Week. Tune in next week for me to have another favorite thing.